The man you see pacing behind an armored truck parked outside 48 West 48th Street near 6th Avenue is considered to be an opportunist by police. It's 48th Street, and people know that the jewelry district is 48th, 47th Street, that all these buildings have jewelers in it. The man paced for about two minutes. Then, while two guards stepped away from the truck, he swooped in, swiped an 86-pound bucket, and bolted. Security is on the top of my mind on a daily basis. The heist happened September 29th, around 4.30 in the afternoon. Other surveillance video captures him bobbing and weaving between crowds of people heading east toward 3rd Avenue. At one point, putting down the five-gallon sealed unmarked pail filled with gold shavings. The journey taking him one hour to complete. If the suspect was able to open up the sealed container, this is what he would have found. Here's an example of those gold shavings. What's left over after a jeweler puts a gemstone into a ring. This material is obviously worth money. When melted at refineries throughout the city in the New Jersey area, there's great value to this. But jewelers agree with police, saying... He probably didn't even know what's in there. He probably has no clue. Police believe the suspect saw an opportunity, figured whatever was in the armored truck was valuable. And in fact, it is. The pail stolen ended up holding $1.6 million worth of gold flakes that were on the way to Canada. Police say they got a tip that the suspect could be in Miami or in Orlando. In Midtown, Reagan Meggie, CBS 2 News.